Spirit, do you grow old? I do! <laughs> ah. Ah. Mm. Are spirits lives so short? My time upon this globe is very brief. I believe it will end upon the stroke of 12. One. Now, but Spirit, I have learned so much from you. Nothing Scrooge could do or say could stop the relentless march of those terrible bells. Five. Oh, Spirit, do not leave me. I think I must, in fact. You have meant so much to me. You have changed me. And now I leave you with the ghost of Christmas yet to come. You mean the future? Mm. Must I? Go forth and know him better, man. <laughs> Am I in the presence of the ghost of Christmas yet to come? Spirit, I fear you more than any spectre I have yet met. Oh, this is too scary. I don't think I want to see any more. No, when you're right, you're right. You're on your own, folks. We'll meet you at the finale. Yeah. Oh. Um... I am prepared to follow and to learn with a thankful heart. Will you not speak to me? Oh, yes, yes. The night is waning fast. Lead on, spirit. I know some of those gentlemen's spirit. Of what poor wretch do they speak? So, back from the house of sadness, I see. <laughs> Said that he didn't die years ago, the old skin flint. Hey, <laughs> hey, hey, yeah. Well, let me see. What do you got for old Joe, eh? What do you got for me to remember him by? Uh, well, I got these collar buttons from his dresser. <laughs> Mother of... Well, no, 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 no. I got his bed curtains. Very fine damask. <laughs> Very cheap damask. Worth a few coins. No, I've got his blankets. <gasps> his blankets? Why, Mrs. Dilber, they're still warm. And don't pay extra for the warmth, you know. You should. He's the only warmth he ever had. <laughs> I understand, Spirit. The case of this unhappy man might be my own. My, my life tends that way now. Merciful heavens. Let me see some tenderness connected with this world, or I'll be haunted by that terrible conversation forever. It's Bob Cratchit's house. Oh, yes, Spirit. A place of joy and laughter. Thank you for bringing me here. So quiet. Why is it so quiet, Spirit? <gasps> oh, Mother, you're crying again. Oh, 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 look, it's just the lamp light. It hurts my eyes. <laughs> Not Tiny Tim. There, there now. Get weak in the, in the dim light. 
And I would not want to show weak eyes to your father when he gets home for anything in the world. And he should be back now. I think he's walked a little slower these past two evenings. Hello, my dears. Daddy. Oh. Hello, girls. Hello, Peter. Hello. Children, please, please go set the table. Thank you. Oh. How was the churchyard? Well, it'll be lovely, Emily. It would have done you good to see how green the place is. <laughs> I, I picked a spot for Tim where he can see. Uh, it's, it's a spot on the hill. And you can see the ducks on the river. Tiny Tim. Tiny Tim always loved watching the ducks on the river. Oh, spirit. Must there be a Christmas that brings this awful scene? How can we endure it? It's all right, children. Life is made up of meetings and partings. That is the way of it. I am sure we shall never forget Tiny Tim or this first parting that there was among us. Must we return to this place? There's something else that I must know. Is that not true? Spirit, I know what I must ask. I fear to, but I must. Who was the wretched man whose death brought so much glee and happiness to others? Answer me one more question. Are these the shadows of things that will be, or are they the shadows of things that may be only? These events can be changed. A life can be made right. <laughs> Ebenezer the Scrooge. Oh, please, spirit, no. Hear me, I, I'm not the man I was. Why would you show me this if I was past all hope? <laughs> I, I will honor Christmas and try to keep it all the year. I will live my life in the past, the present, and the future. I will not shut out the lessons the spirits have taught me. Tell me that I may sponge out the writing on this stone. <laughs> Oh, Spirit, please speak to me. <laughs>